It's a good day from Sunny Approach here, and we are working on uh, the garden and putting uh, fertilizer in with the water. It is fertilizer time. So um, here's half a teaspoon because my one teaspoon won't fit in the top of this thing. So what we're doing, it needs between two and three gallons of water to fill all the way up. Um, one day it says two, the next day it says three. So we're gonna put two full teaspoons in here, which is for these half teaspoons. And I put some more water out ready. And then we're gonna put the warm water in with this and dissolve this fertilizer. Oh. It's pink. I was expecting brown. I thought it might be blue. Or green. <laughs> so this stuff they call it veg and bloom. Mm -hmm. Tap hard from the garden system. And it's guaranteed by hydroponic <coughs> research. Oh. It's not all going into this by basically three ounces of liquid. So I'm gonna put it back in the can cup and fertil up. See if we can all get it all dissolved. Get it all dissolved. They say do one teaspoon per gallon, so, you know. Again, just like everybody else, you don't always follow the directions. Not always the best thing in life, but, you know, you live and learn. Well, we're going to have the right proportion here. It's just... Right. It's just, it's just not all, and maybe it's not supposed to, but that is definitely not all, even in the cup. Yeah. And there's a little bit left here in, the, mm -hmm. in this stuff, you can see. So I'm, we'll, sure, I'm sure it'll be good enough. Yeah. All right, so let's go walk over to the garden system and say hi to Cappuccino along the way. I think he's there. He is. Oh, okay. I thought he went outside. Yeah. And you want to grab that water? Mm-hmm. Well, we're going to put the water in first before. Yes. This is the last thing we put in. Okay. Well, I'll go say hi to Cappuccino while you get some I'll water get to yep. actually pull in. And we're going to go. Where's Cappuccino? Oh, there he is. Unsurprisingly, Cappuccino is snuggled up in the recliner. Hi Cappuccino. Everybody's wondering, are you enjoying growing in the garden too? What do you think? You just had to go outside, didn't you? It's very, very windy outside today. So while we're getting the water ready, we've already taken off the filler cap. So as we said, there's a need for about three gallons of water added in there. But all of the plants are looking pretty healthy. I'm especially pleased with how the romaine lettuce is looking. And if we come up here, the cilantro. Green tatsoi. There's the brain. Red mustard. Oh! Alright. So I got that. These are full gallons. So. But yeah, you can see there's not much water in that. Put some of this in. Of course, when the pump runs, it will circulated all around anyway. Yeah. So we just need to fill it, finish filling it up and then it'll be all ready okay. to go. While you do that, I'll keep giving a bit of the tour of the okay. plants as they're looking right now. So this is the 15th day that we have had this. So there's mint and kale, jalapenos, yellow cherry tomato, kale lucinta, Sweet peppers. It's a mini cauliflower. The red cherry tomatoes. The romaine we looked at earlier. The thyme. If you haven't seen our full unboxing video, I um, certainly encourage you to do that if you're thinking about buying one of these garden systems. And we've also covered how there's these cameras, and these cameras watch the garden system all the time for you 
And so if something needs to be done, then Kelby, who's the AI gardening assistant, will let you know that you need to do something. Second water water. And I put some more water in my measuring cup here so that will all go down into the thing or try to get more of it down. To the reservoir. Probably not too cold, but that's what I think. I'm going to tell you, if we decide to move this, we're going to let this thing go down for like a gallon. He's going to yell at me every day. Well, I do know that at some point in the next 10, 15 days or something, we have to actually drain it. No, it's in like another 30 days. Another 30 days, okay. Uh, yeah. You can see actually the fertilizer actually in the water, but I'm sure you can't no, it's see little, it with the camera. A little too dark with the camera. So there you have it. That is what you have to do if you've got an indoor garden system. And we will return back with more adventures of this system on a daily basis. So if you want to follow along, I invite you to subscribe to our channel at Sunny Approach. Hit that little bell so that you get notified when we drop the new daily video. And certainly appreciate all of the comments and questions that you have. Do our best to answer any that you might have. Have a sunny day.